You know, the, the very first uh, war that uh, comes to my head thinking of this piece is fun. It's fun. It must be, and it must be really played with fun and with, with, with energy. Um, this is also very beautiful and very important because we tend to see contemporary music, especially European contemporary music, and also some of, of the American as something very, very dense, very intellectual, also very tragical. And uh, the music by Ligeti is uh, everything but this. It's very brilliant. Uh, of course, there are also dramatic moments, but generally, it's a very positive music. And uh, this being so positive gives to us, to the performance, such a beautiful energy. And of course, uh, we, we just can hope to, to, uh, to transfer this to the audience as well. Let me say one thing more about the piano. In, uh, what is so beautiful in this piece is that as much as also in the orchestra and in the orchestration and in the score, the piano uh, becomes all the pianos of the piano history. In one movement you are Chopin, but even in the same movement, maybe 10 bars later, you are a gamelan, an Indonesian gamelan. Uh, one bar before you are a jazz, you must play like Jerry Roll Morton. Uh, or, uh, um, so it's the idea of the piano sound and also in the orchestra is the same. Uh, so many memories and also so many homage. Sometimes it's really a little bit tongue-in-cheek, of course, but in such a clever way that uh, it makes you laugh and it, it, it catches your, uh, your, it grips you. Uh, I think it's really, I mean, it was, it was definitely as maybe uh, one of the very tops or highlights of his career and it's one of the last pieces he wrote. Um, to me it's probably the highlight maybe. For a pianist is anyway a very big, uh, very, very big pleasure and uh, incredible uh, uh, challenge, artistical challenge to, to play it.